I had a request today for support on how to use MetaTitler app for Shopify. So I'm going to go through it step by step and show you how simple it is. I'm going to sign up and I'm going to put the name of my app in and I'm going to authenticate and I'm going to say, sure, give me this app with two links added to my store. And now I'm back at my store and I'm going to capture this little bit of liquid here, copy it to my clipboard. I'm going to go to the theme of my app here, and I'm going to open up Theme Liquid. I'm going to grab the existing template that I put in here, and I'm going to simply paste in what I had. So you can see what I've basically done is put into the head here this little liquid snippet that I provide. And that will simply dump out the page or the product meta fields into the title, the meta name title, and the meta name description. So we're going to save that. And we're now going to take advantage of this for SEO. So let's go to a product grassroots client server. And let's set some metadata for this. So let's say we want this to be grassroots. Let's say grass grows on my lawn. And for an actual description to get the search engines interested, we'll say get off my lawn, punk. And we'll submit that. So we've submitted, we've saved, we're back at the product here. Let's take a look at what that's like on the actual website. Not much action going on until we go grassroots client server. Oh, hey, look at that. Grass grows on my lawn. There's the title. And if we do a quick view of the source, there's the meta title. Not that that's interesting for most people, but here's the description. Get off my lawn, punk. Wasn't that easy? And we've also got the title, of course, which you saw. Grass grows on my lawn. So that was pretty simple. Now, if we wanted to do a page we could create a new page. We could call this page Bacon. And we could say Bacon is good. And we can create that page. If we want to see this page, we can go to Pages Bacon. So let's first set some metadata on that. Let's say we want this to be scary. Indeed, it is eating bacon, that's the title, and now let's say to ourselves here that there is a nice sunset outside. Google will eat that up. It all makes total sense, right? That's your page. Let's go back to Shopify here. We know we've got a page and we want to see it. It's called uh, bacon. So let's pull that up. Oh, scary indeed it is eating bacon. There's our title. And again, if we do a quick view source, we'll see the description is now set to there's a nice sunset outside. So that was simple. That's all there is to it. Using this app, you can boost your SEO by simply editing your products and pages. So let me know if you have any problems, and I hope that screencast helped you out.